Macross Plus Volume 2 contains the ultimate virtual reality concert sequence that brings you to the incredible cyberspace of enchanting Sharon Apple, the artificial intelligence singer. Sharon's concert tour reunites the mutual friends Isamu, Nguyen, and Gold as if this fate wants to reawaken their mixed feelings for one another. This turns Isamu and Gold's testing of new Valkyries into a life-threatening competition. Macross Plus Volume 2 is packed with thrill, romance, and unbelievable animation that you've never encountered before. to overtake mankind and Earth. Modern weapons are no match for the netherworld creatures. Only a demon can kill a demon, but only one who is pure at heart can possess the body of a demon. Akira Fudo is chosen to become Devilman, but will his power even be enough for the deadly Sidon? Devilman is anime that will grab your soul. <laughs>
you come along quietly like a good boy, you may just avoid the firing squad for the three murders you've committed. Now walk towards me, slowly. Up yours, sister! Who are you calling sister? You're even more stupid than I thought. Now you may be mad! I'm in. Oh. I'm in. Oh. Oh. oh, my heart! If you don't back off, I'll blow his brains. Shut up! So depressing having to deal with idiots like you. Kill the hostage and you lose your only protection. So you only have two options, you poor dumb schmuck. You can give yourself up, or you can kill the hostage and then feel the stroke of my stun gun, meaning lots of broken bones and life in the prison or hospital. So be a good boy and I won't shoot you. Not now, anyway. Ow! Because I'm feeling generous, I'm going to count to ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Why nine, don't you ten! Don't you no! Morning, Chief. And many citizens are questioning the tactics of our police. Keep going. You're clear. I can see the exit. Just keep going straight. Go on. Uh, uh. What's up? Are we stuck? Nothing to worry about. Just keep going straight. We'll soon be out. The crowd even felt sorry for that punk criminal, and that spells trouble for us. It can't go on! I've told you before! Hey, chill out, Chief. We're dealing with the scum in the only way that they can understand, and you know that. All I know is that you're destroying the city and making us more hated than the criminals! Take a look at this. Tank, Tank police out! Tank police out! Tank police out! Why pay Tank taxes to destroy out. our city? You're Tank worse than the criminals! Out. Take police out! Take police out! <laughs> they love you, Chief. Yes, that's quite a welcome. Don't you lot have any respect? It would appear that the tank police are doing more harm than good. That's not fair! When will you learn that there's more to police duty than catching criminals? What about protecting the property and the rights of our citizens? Maintaining peace and security on the streets so that ordinary citizens can go safely about their business? Hey, that's a great election speech. That may be so, but I also happen to believe in what I'm saying, Captain. You're supposed to protect our citizens, not threaten them. And don't forget, they pay your wages! Because of your excessive use of force, my desk is piled high with complaints! There's a murder every 30 seconds in this city and an act of terrorism every 25 minutes! Just take today's little party, for instance. Take a good look. These are known as type 4 virtual drugs. Think of them as narcotics for electronic brains. There's more than enough here to overdose every computer in the city, probably the whole country. That heavy enough for you, ma'am? Which would you rather have? Terrorists holding the city to ransom, shutdowns of all services, people dying everywhere, or a little bit of noise when we make an arrest? And what's more, Madam Mayor, the terrorists are now targeting the police directly, and we have reports of a new type of mobile weapon on the rampage in the Eastern Ward. But there are many different ways to skin a cat, my friends. Huh? Mm -hmm. Who are you, may I ask? I beg your pardon. My name is Higashi Nada from Tank Division 3. I'm here to do a short study of your department. Yes, headquarters has specifically ordered Detective Higashi Nada to prepare a report on all the activities of our unique tank battalion. Our activities? Yes, headquarters is awash with rumors regarding the activities of this battalion, and the little demonstration party today won't look good. A more intelligent approach to the situation would have been better received by the public. What? How dare you, you little prick, you Thanks jerk. for the advice, but we have our own way of doing things around here. Hmm. Uh, Britain! At any rate, I want the tank police to exercise some self-control. You're down to one patrol a day in the future, and that's 
An order! seems to have regained control. Yes, me. How situation. are you fixed for tonight? Great. Oh, come on. Hmm. Bloody useless! However, the statistics appear to show an improvement. Terrorist attacks totaled 34 this week, and this can be seen as good news because that's 20% down from last week. Captain? Why, there you are. Now, let me see. Captain, I have a message for you from the head of admin. He wants a written report of events last week. Oh, you're already doing it. He also wants details on the equipment reduction now in force for the tank battalion. Can't you see I'm doing it? Hey, say, has anyone seen the armor-piercing shells I had here? <gasps> no, sorry, can't help you. Sorry. Hey, Al, are you there? Hmm? Yes, what is it? That guy, Higashi Nada, doesn't he give you the creeps? I didn't like the way he was staring at us as if he was scrutinizing us. He's just interested in our tank battalion. He's pretty hot himself, practically born and bred in HQ's Tank Division 3. How do you know? He's a tank ace. He won the Police Commissioner's Medal 24 times and the Mayor's Gratitude Medal 11 times. He's no stranger to combat. Oh, I get it. You've been up to your tricks hacking into HQ's main frame And the armor-piercing and... shells? Okay, we're even, but that guy still gives me the heebie-jeebies. He makes my skin crawl. I was wiping his glasses. It's creepy. What is it that you find so creepy? And that's all for uh -huh. us. Stand by for the weather after the break. <clears throat> what are you doing here? Don't you know that this area is for special personnel only? Yes, I have authorization, and all I want is a brief conversation with the officers who were present at the scene this morning. I'm not arguing that tanks have a definite deterrent effect, but don't you agree that they're a little too crude and bulky to handle all the subtleties of street crime? After all, they're not very delicate, are they? And what does that mean? <coughs> what, what exactly are you saying? It's my belief that a smaller, more powerful, and above all, more mobile weapon would be far more effective in combating the type of crime you encountered this morning. Are you saying that you're not satisfied with the tank battalion? I'd be happier if you hadn't caused quite so much damage. Nice idea, but totally hypothetical, because that type of weapon doesn't exist, does it? As the good book says, seek and ye shall find, knock and the door shall be opened unto you. Oh well, I have things to do, places to go, and people to see. By the way, that diminutive tank... Bonaparte to you! Oh, sorry, yes, well, okay, Bonaparte. Well, its starter is a little sluggish. It could get you into trouble. You should check the electromagnetic clutch. Hasta mañana, gentlemen and lady. What an arrogant little prick. A tank ace my ass. More like an ace jerk. How dare he go and suggest that there's something wrong with my Bonaparte? He's right. What? I noticed the clutch, too, and it isn't sounding too good. She's still operating within specs, but I was going to have her checked out next week. You were? Yes, during scheduled maintenance. Oh. Oof. I don't care what you say, he still gives me the creeps. Please. 
bastards are using grenade launchers, so make sure your Vulcan cannons and all your portable missiles are at the ready. Now let's get out there and blast them to hell. Yes, yes sir. sir! Dinner on me for whoever gets the first direct hit. Sounds good. I'll go for that. Don't count on it. He only said that because he's sure he'll win. Britain, what the hell are you playing at? Who ordered you to mobilize? Stand down now! What was that? Sorry, Chief, I can't hear you! I said you were to mobilize on my authority only! Get back! Yes, sir, mobilize on your authority. Yes, I fully understand, sir. I'm with you there. Of course, the armored patrol cars, pretty as they are, won't be able to handle a situation, so you're sending us in. Well, that leaves us no choice, team. We'll do everything to support our Chief. Britain, I said stand down now! As you've all heard, the Chief has come down here especially to see us off and boost our morale. So all together, everyone, thank you, sir! Thank, thank you, you, sir! See you when we get back! Ready? Forward! <laughs> to you? Don't worry, she'll be fine once the oil pressure increases. It's no big deal, Leona. As the maintenance engineer, I think you should take more care with Bonaparte. <laughs> this is the life, the throb of the engine, the wind on my face, the ground trembling beneath. Hey, now, give us some sound. <laughs> this little baby's gonna kiss their asses goodbye. <laughs> Prepare to die. <laughs> oh, baby, oh. <laughs> 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 Leona? Captain, it's headed your way on the monorail tracks. Yo, Nam, get ready to hit the monorail. That's where the bastard will be. Uh -huh. <laughs> higher, Nam, aim higher. 
<laughs> the tank police are now on a one-way ticket to the scrap heap. <laughs> Shit, the bastard knows we can't hit him from this angle. What now, Captain? <laughs> oh, shit! Retreat! What was that? Atmospheric explosive. The shell he just fired contains the catalyst. When it reacts with argon, it causes multi-directional explosions. Who the hell is behind that thing? It sure as hell beats me, but all I know is that if we don't stop him, it's out of us to our fair city as we know it. Now, fix me up a smokescreen. Now we move into the playground. All right. A smoke bomb? They insult me with such a childish trick. We're picking up a heat source. What? It's got a laser. A laser in such a small unit? Back up. We'll hide behind that building. For the time being, anyway. Camp. The left front wheel's been hit! <laughs> so this is the mighty tank police. What a pathetic outfit. <sighs> well, the game's over for you boys now. Don't go too far without backup. But, sir, we can't let him get away now. We're right on his tail. Yeah. All right, but take it easy, you two. I don't hell know how, but he seems to know all our technical limitations, and he's got a laser cannon. So make sure you stay well out of his range. A laser? Captain? What? You owe me dinner, sir. What? Don't you remember, sir? Oh, well, sure I do. What? <gasps> Britain's gone down. Who the hell managed that? We're trying to find out, sir. Excuse me, Chief. We've just received a report that the body of Detective Higashinada has been found at the airport. What? When? How? They've just discovered the body, sir, but the airport doctor estimates that he died yesterday shortly after arriving. What? My God. If it's as they say, then who the hell was it who was here this morning? our armor as if it was paper. How dare that bastard scratch my tank? I've got an idea. What are they up to now? Yeah. Using water to refract the beam. Clever, but not clever enough. Check it out. We'll take the far elevator. <gasps> Hold it a sec, Al. What's up? Goddamn shit! They disobeyed orders and used a forbidden weapon! Cheating bastards! Huh? They're coming up! Not 
after your old smoke bomb routine again. At least they seem to be obeying orders this time. It won't do much good, though. You can't hide from infrared rays. Item 7. You have three demonstration classes today, and everybody, I mean everybody, is required to attend. If you don't know which class you're supposed to be in, check the list by the door. But I that don't want was any some surprise finding a Gashinata in that mobile you weapon. You can say that again. I'm totally confused. What the hell was he doing? Search me. I don't understand it either. I mean, what were his motives? Haven't you heard? Apparently, he wasn't Detective Higashinata at all. He was someone else. Someone completely different. Not a police officer. You mean he was a fake? The body they found at the airport yesterday was the real Detective Higashinata. You mean the fake killed him and then tricked everyone into believing that he was the real Detective Higashinata? It's amazing what a little rubber and some makeup skills can do for a man. But we still don't know why he did it and why he attacked the tank police. Well, it seems he invented that mobile weapon and he was promised by a senior official of the Justice Ministry that it would be procured for the tank police. Then the official asked to have the plans and that was the last our friend saw of his invention. The official stole his plans and Agashinada had the misfortune to be the go-between in the negotiations. What are we going to do? What can we do? Such a peaceful day. Yeah, it's a nice feeling, but maybe it's only because of the rain. Lucky, though, as most of the station is empty because of that big march today demanding the disbanding of the tank police. Thanks for reminding me. I managed to forget about it for a second. Bastards. Well, perhaps that way we'll all get early retirements. 
She bought it. What a dreadful way to go. She was a sweet girl, good looking too, and real good at her job. How come you know her? From Osaka. She was a bike cop over there. Charon. I said no, and that means no! I will not allow you to exceed the limits of your authority, do you hear? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Here! Request for leave of absence! Boy, does she look mad. Hey, I want Bonaparte's keys! Mm -hmm. Nice one! Very accurate. Date of entry, August 10, 2016. Saki tank police officer contract status terminated. each other for a while. I'll be so lonely without you. You love it, don't you? I only have to turn my back for a second. You're at it again. I can't help it. It's the feel of cold metal. It makes me all tingly. <laughs> really? All units, all units proceeding. Duelli Street, robbery in progress, I repeat, robbery in progress on Duelli Street, suspects in stolen garbage truck, I repeat, suspects in stolen garbage truck, all units pursue, all units. You drive off shoot. Damn! Hey, Taryn, we'll never catch him from behind. The highway forks up ahead. We'll get them at the next slip road. Gotcha! Come and get her! How do you like that? Hey, where the hell's she gone? Huh? Hey, boys, Mama's gonna have to give you a hiding! Ah, shut your face! Yeah. Allow me to rearrange your makeup! <laughs> <laughs> hey, boss, look up front! Huh? Shit! Stop! I said stop! Turn around! Time pass!
I thought I might find you here. Huh? Uh, uh Leona? Oh. Yeah, Captain, we want to see too. That's only fair, Captain. Allow your men to see for themselves. Be quiet! Have you guys no delicacy? Yes, Madam Mayor. I must say it was an excellent plan. It's all gone like clockwork. Good. Your blood is really up. That's what I hope to hear. Keep me informed. We must find out more about the Dai Nippon Gaikian Research Corporation. Yeah, that's right, and according to the voice prints, it was our two friends, the Puna twins, Anna and Uni. How about that for a surprise? <gasps> Anna and Uni? Hey, you two, come back here right now! She doesn't give up, does she? Yeah, she's sticking to us like a fly to shit. Next turn, ride! Right you are. She's still behind us! Her short little legs must be tiring. Uh, Do you see what I see? Let's try and jump it. Uh oh, what did I tell you? Enjoyed your little fun, eh? Reporting murders to the police. Oh, what do you mean, enjoyed our little fun? Well, how dare you adopt that tone of voice with us? Yes, we shouldn't have to ask for respect. How dare you mention the word respect? What evil, twisted minds to get enjoyment out of reporting the death of your own victim! What? We have not done anything wrong! Yeah, we try and do our duty like good citizens and all we get is aggravation. Typical! Typical. Is that so? Then why were you running? I'm telling you the truth, I promise. We only found the body. Yeah, we don't know nothing. Yeah, that's right. What'd you get? Captain! Captain Britain! Well, I checked through the files and found Charon's name on the personnel list of the Dynap and Geiken Research Corporation. I wonder what that's all about. I mean, it's not exactly... Ow? Exa <laughs> Ow? The captain's not with you, is he? Uh, uh, so, uh, sorry, Sophie, he's not here, but I think he might be on the shooting range. Thanks, Al. These reports are starting to build up, and he's so difficult to pin and down. And if you look at all the other names on the list, it... Are you still there? Hello? Leona? Don't hang up! It says her employment was terminated only yesterday. I think we should be careful. She might be a plant. On the other hand, she's got what we're looking for. Plenty of potential there. Excuse me. Huh? Allow me to introduce myself. Here. 
Newport Temporary Labor Agency? Temporary Labor Services? I could offer you a very good job. Hmm. Tell me, are you uh, content in your present employment? Sorry, but I'm very busy right now. You know, you remind me of a young biker lady I found work for. It was an excellent job. She really liked it. Very well paid, too. But I assure you, it wasn't anything illegal or immoral. What do you think you're doing? Huh? A big, strong man like you should know better. Don't you realize that the city provides proper receptacles for your cigarette butts, sweetie wrappers, chewing gum, and other trash? Uh, but, but you'll have to excuse me. I'm very busy right now. If you you are not getting away that easily. Don't think you can commit such a disgraceful act of vandalism in front of the vice president of the Newport Environmental Protection Society and just walk away like that. I want you to clean up your mess, young man. It's because of people like you that we, the law-abiding majority, lady. have Listen to live to in the city of I'm the captain that of the best 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 police coming. division in this city, and I have a job to do. Back up! Back up! Further back! More! This is a gigantic building site. Yes, they're building a whole new city within a city. It's impressive, isn't it? We supplied a lot of the labor for this project. Our offices are at the back. It allows us to be on site and also keeps costs down. Follow me. That's definitely him. There's no doubt about that. That's bad news for her. I bet that tattooed creep's a professional hitman. That little cop sis is gonna end up like this. Oh. Blah! It won't be very pretty. <laughs> I told him. I bloody told him. Bloody, bloody told him. I stink at steakhouse. God damn it! Well, these are our facilities, about which I'll explain more in detail shortly. Then I'll conduct an in-depth interview to determine what kind of work you are interested in and what you're good at. But first, there's a short medical. That motorcyclist woman you told me about, did she also get an explanation of the facilities and an in-depth interview? Yes, and the medical exam. Down a bit, down to the left. <gasps> Bonaparte? I'm terribly sorry about the construction noise. I'm afraid it can't be helped, but I know it's most irritating. However, you just sit back and relax and concentrate on the screen in front of you, okay? Welcome. I extend my warmest greetings. I am forever hopeful that we can increase the ranks of our human assets with those followers who are willing to help me realize my dream. Realize your dream? <laughs> the only thing we need to do is add a little polish to those well-developed strengths you have trained so hard to perfect. And there'll be no need for any more arduous training. All I require is that you go to sleep for a short while, and when you awaken, you will truly be one of my followers and a blessed human asset. Who are you? What's up? That's my little chicken off to sleep. You're not getting away like the last girl. I wasn't any good at the subtle stuff. You know I'm hopeless at following. Uh, hopeless is the right word, you Hello, brainless lump of blood! Can't you do anything right for once? Yes. I thought I could rely on you. Yes, I get you. Up. But no, what? you had to go. Please loser. repeat that. You lose a tank and a yes, tank thank you very much.
You're awake, most unfortunate. What do you mean? What's going on? Why the hell am I tied up? And you could have had it so easy. If you hadn't been so feisty, you could have slept through the whole operation and not known about a thing. Oh well, too bad. Let's get started. No! Stop! Wait, wait! Uh, tell me what? What, what? what are you going to do to me? What does it matter? I may as well tell you you can't escape and you won't remember a thing afterwards anyhow. You have had the honor of being selected to work for our organization after this short but necessary brain operation. Work for who? For that shadowy figure who appeared on the screen? Is he the one behind all this? You girls ask a lot of questions. That biker girl was just the same, never stopped asking questions, but what difference does it make? You're hired now. And there'll be no escape, so you may as well just lie back and relax. I knew it! Sharon went through this too, didn't she? <laughs> yes, but she was very silly. She escaped and thought she could get away. I disposed of her very easily. Bonaparte? That goddamn noise! Wait till I get hold of the jerk who decided to put me out here. <laughs> what the? Hey, where's Leona? <laughs> Leona! Leona, Leona, wake up! <sighs> It's not responding, the system's locked! Come on, come on! Leona! Personally, I find that the simplest methods are often the best. Yeah! Watch it, you fool! You'll pay for this! He's making a run for it! Quick! Stand in at 11 o'clock! Fire! Ah! Yes! Right between the eyes! Oh? It's a fucking cyborg! Huh? But you haven't got a cyborg head, have you, punk? Yeah. Four eyes, contact the station. Oh, that was wonderful, Captain. Just like Dirty Harry. I've always wanted to do that, but don't tell anyone. Yo, Captain! Hey, Leona, are you okay? Huh? <laughs> oh! Oh! Whoa! Ah! Get it, get it, help me! She seems just help fine me, to me. me. Hold it, Leona! He's the bastard who killed Sharon. He told me all about it back there. Let me get it! I don't know what you're talking about. You lying bastard! He told me he killed her when she tried to escape! I really don't know what she's going on about, but she seems a little soft in the head to me. Soft in the head? Get her off me! I'm making a complaint about police harassment. Looks like they got her out just in time. Thanks to us, we deserve a reward for our information. Madam Mayor, police headquarters on line two. Oh, thank you. Hello? Fine, thank you. I'm sorry, Madam Mayor. Unfortunately, it looks as if the lizard has only lost its tail. Don't you? Hey, Leona, stop kicking me. Ah, uh, you're always complaining.
Item 10, traffic duty. Unit 7, you're to proceed to the northwest section where you will join up with traffic units 15 and 16. Your brief is to patrol B block and don't forget your gas mask. The mold clouds are worse than normal today. That's all for now, folks. Return! I've been waiting three days for those reports. Did you hear what I just said? Damn it! Doesn't anyone ever listen to me? We don't just like our job, we love it! Nothing stands in our way, so beware, you creeps out there! Another day, another danger for Leona and the tank police! What? A truck filled with explosives is headed this way! Let's go! If we don't stop it, it'll be curtains for the whole city! I don't believe it! The tank police versus the truck of death! This is no joke, fellas. This guy means business. You won't get out of hand this time! We already are!